Couch and Green Community is a recognized voice of food security for the Couch and region, and we develop innovative ways to educate the public on this issue. Our focus is agriculture, youth, and environmental education, and we see the impact of our work in the community every day through the many programs and initiatives we offer. In 2013, CGC delivered a total of 170 workshops, events, and programs. We also operated four social enterprises, through which we generated core funding. In addition, the purchase of the former Phoenix Station Motor Inn will support us in becoming self-sustaining. Part of our commitment to increasing food security is to create opportunities that meet our community's interest to learn and acquire the necessary food skills. CGC reached over 8,000 people through hosting 16 events and partnering on another 15. These included the annual Duncan Seedy Saturday, where seed sellers and gardeners meet and learn, the Earth Day celebration in Charles Huey Park, the Growing Connections Mixer, which linked food producers and purchasers, the annual Edible Garden Tour, showcasing creative backyard vegetable gardens, the GMO rally that gave voice to citizens' concerns about the introduction of GMOs to our soil, and a land-linking workshop with BC's young agrarians in an effort to connect landowners with eager new farmers. Our creative team also produced 11 workshops that included the Organic Master Gardeners course, Introduction to Permaculture, Fruit Tree Care and Pruning, Wild Food Foraging, Food Skills for Families in Partnership with the Canadian Diabetes Association, Mason Bee Care, and Cheese Making. In partnership with the CVRD, we delivered over 120 environment education workshops focusing on zero waste, transportation, and water conservation, reaching over 2,500 students. We also worked with green teams at Shimena Secondary School and Queen Margaret School to assist them in reaching their goals of becoming zero waste institutions. In addition, we produced the 12 Big Ideas monthly e-newsletter for the CVRD's Environment Commission. Since 2007, CGC has been turning its vision of urban agriculture in the heart of Duncan into reality. The Kinsman Community Neighborhood Park has become the site of a thriving, youth-run urban farm where we've cultivated an urban demonstration farm and social enterprise. We've supplied local restaurants and farmers market patrons with our famous and delicious kale and other fresh herbs and veggies. We trained six youth facing barriers to employment in organic horticulture, who successfully took those skills onto other full-time paying jobs. The creation of this youth-focused farm has also led to work experience partnerships with Vancouver Island University's Employability Skills Training class and Cowichan Secondary School Life Skills class. These 40 students joined us at the park every week to help weed the garden, plant seeds, harvest produce, and build soil, providing them with valuable social and employment skills. Canada's official opposition leader, Thomas Mulcair, along with MP Jean Crowder, toured Kin Park on a Vancouver Island tour in August, one of only three stops he made on his visit to the island. Mr. Mulcair was incredibly impressed and encouraged by the interns' mission to grow food and their passion to teach others in the community. The 2013 map was the fourth edition of CGC's hugely successful Farm Fresh Food Guide to the Cowichan Valley. 70 farms were listed, 13 of which were new participants from past editions. 10,000 copies of the map were distributed throughout the region. The Buy Local, Buy Fresh map reflects CGC's mandate to improve food security regionally, increase the growth of farmers in the market, and link consumers to local food, which is a cornerstone to building a resilient community. The Cowichan Agriculture Market Research Project ran until May. We investigated the barriers that inhibit connections between Cowichan region farmers and purchasers. We identified tools and resources that could help increase market opportunities for farmers. The results of this six-month research project were compiled into a free handbook, Growing Connections, a handbook for purchasers and farmers in the Cowichan region, which was shared at a hugely successful networking event in May at Alderley Farm and Cafe.
Operating for its eighth year, our Fruit Save program gleans thousands of pounds of fruit, which is then weighed and sorted and given to those in need. The main goal of the Fruit Save project is to harvest fruit that would otherwise go to waste and distribute this valuable resource to 18 local emergency food providers. Over one ton of fruit was harvested by 40 Fruit Save volunteers on 24 properties in the region. This program helps low-income residents access fresh local food by providing weekly coupons to purchase produce, meat and eggs. CGC was instrumental in bringing this program to the Duncan Farmers Market. We supported 40 families and 10 seniors in our community and over $10,000 in revenue went directly into the hands of our local farmers. In partnership with the Canadian Diabetes Association, we also offered free cooking classes to recipients of the coupon program. Participants learned about nutrition and basic cooking skills in this six-week hands-on workshop held at our new commercial kitchen. Through a partnership with Vancouver Island Regional Library, a weekly summer story time program ran at Kin Park, encouraging an interest in reading as well as teaching young children about growing food. Where there used to be needles and violence, now families gather to share the wonders of nature, sample fresh berries, and identify beneficial insects. Ceres offers organic horticulture services to residents in the region, from garden consultations and quality yard maintenance to permaculture design and installation. By helping people to plant and grow more edible plants in their gardens and patios, we're working towards cultivating a resilient, sustainable, and healthy future. We also operate a resource center and food security focused thrift store, which was visited by over 4,000 people. The Garden Pantry Thrift Store contains items that complement CGC's focus on food security. You'll find gardening and farming tools, canning jars, kitchenware, and books. Everything you'll need to help grow, harvest, and cook your own food. Operated by a dedicated group of volunteers, all proceeds from the store help to support CGC's community projects. Our very bold move to purchase the old Phoenix Station Motor Inn was definitely the most challenging yet rewarding project that we undertook in 2013. Amid a myriad of unanticipated setbacks and complications, it is to the credit of a very strong and cohesive board of directors who held fast onto the vision that this project still flourished. Through this social purpose real estate project, the station, we created safe, affordable housing. This incredible community asset will generate a more sustainable revenue stream supporting our programs while at the same time rejuvenating the downtown core and creating a safer, more vibrant neighborhood. We continued to work with other partners including the Island Farmers Alliance where CGC was instrumental in supporting them during a difficult year. We still offer the Cowichan Community Bike Trailers in partnership with the Cowichan Recyclists for community members to use free of charge. We supported Transition Cowichan and Cycle Cowichan for another year. We helped with Operation Underpants again, collecting over 800 pairs of underwear for those in need. We supported Meals on the Ground, a program offering free meals three times a week. And we were continually available to help with other community organizations initiatives such as GE Free BC, the Central Island Seed Savers Network, and Young Agrarians. To our 138 members, 167 donors, 258 volunteers who logged almost 2,000 hours, our countless funders and other supporters, and of course our dedicated board of directors, all the staff of CGC thank you for helping us grow. With your support, we are able to continue working towards a more sustainable and food secure future for the Cowichan region.